Hi YouTube, Tim Unkert from UnkertEducation.com here. In this video, I'm going to show you the best way to set up live preview in the Pulsar text editor at the time of this recording. But first, if you like videos like this where I show you how to install software and how to set up software, then please subscribe. Okay, so let's get to it. So I have this HTML file here where I took a poem, uh, basically a poem that I had deepai.org write me, and I just surrounded it with HTML tags. Let's say I want to preview it in the browser. Well, I could open the file and refresh, but that's not the best way to do it. I want to preview the changes as they happen without refreshing. So I can do that. I just have to install a package. So I'm going to do control comma to bring up my settings, and I'm going to go to install here. And I'm going to type in live and I'll wait for a moment and I see this package Atom Live Server. I'm going to click install. Okay, once that goes ahead and installs, I can close up my settings and I'll reopen the file here. And what I can do is do Control Shift P and start to type in live. And I can see all these commands Atom Live Server start on port 3000, that's control alt 3. If I want to start on port 4000, that's control alt 4. Port 5000, control alt 5, and so on. I'm going to hit enter to start on port 3000. It's going to open up, and I actually have to click on the file here. So I'm going to click on the file in the folder because it starts live with the folder. Okay, and let's bring back the Pulsar editor here. And I have a max width for my body size of 1100 pixels. Uh, so it looks like this. Okay, let's bring it down to 600 and save it. And now if we go back, it immediately changes here. So I don't, I didn't have to refresh. It just immediately changed the uh, look of the file. So it allows me to quickly build web pages with this package. If you found this video helpful, please give it a like. That would really help. Thank you. 